Hey guys, I get this question a lot, so I wanted to share my answer with you officially today, okay? So what to name my bookkeeping business? So this is the biggest question that I hear most people thinking about. I struggled with this for like probably the, I got started about seven years ago in my bookkeeping and accounting business, um, and it took us like three weeks to figure out a name. Like we'd be sitting at, at the... Um, my uh, kitchen table because I, I had a home-based business. I still have a home-based business. Like I, I work out of my home. We're sitting on the kitchen table and we were just saying, okay, so this name, this name, this name, do we feel anything with this name? And it just took so long. Knowing what I know now, I would have avoided all of that struggle. So the first thing you guys got to do is you guys have to go and you need to go directly to the market, okay? Do not make a big you know, time or fuss about your name. The easiest way for you to get a name and the easiest thing for you to go from zero to about $12,000 per month is to utilize your name. Okay, so for example, Bryce Tubbs Accounting, Bryce Tubbs Bookkeeping, Bryce Tubbs Virtual CFO, Bryce Tubbs XYZ, whatever your service is. That is the best name when you're starting out. Okay, Susan B. Anthony, bookkeeping. Susan B. Anthony, accounting and bookkeeping. Susan B. Anthony, tax prep. Okay, your name plus your service. The reason why it's so important is because when you are first starting out, people are going to be referring people to you. You're going to be using your past life, your friends of friends, your friends. They're going to be coming to you. They are not going to know, for example, guitar players certified Ann Arbor bookkeeping or fancy pants name bookkeeping. No one's gonna know who that is. So you basically have to rebuild a brand from scratch and that takes time and that can take money. Versus if you just use your name, you already have a lifetime of building that brand and you can effectively like, most people have about 30 to $40,000 worth of um, yearly revenue from their existing lifetime. Even if you've never been inside the accounting or bookkeeping space, you generally have enough relationships for you to be able to get some of those people as clients. Now, within there, with those friends of friends, not only do you have you know 30 to 40 from your existing network, but your friends can know someone that can give you more money. Like generally people are only about three degrees of separation from their um, next client or from their next dollar. Okay, so that means a friend of a friend of a friend, okay? But what happens for most people is they end up actually going and just trying to go after this new audience. They want to go and conquer people who they don't know. And that's a lot harder. Okay. If you don't have good sales skills or you don't really have a great marketing strategy, it's really, really hard for you to be able to, you know, cover that ground really quickly, especially if you're going at this alone. Like if you're trying to learn this from like trial and error, it is extremely hard. That's why like, like whenever I'm not working with someone or I haven't, you know, worked them in the mentorship program, I always tell you guys like, go to the people you know first, because then if you do have someone like myself kind of in your corner, which um, if you do want some help growing your account and your bookkeeping business from someone who's been where you're trying to go, go ahead and click on the link inside of the description below to book a call with me. I'll talk about the call at the end of the video, but it's one of the best places for you to get a really accurate understanding and game plan of what you need to do to go and grow your bookkeeping or your accounting business. And if it makes sense, we can even work together long term. Use ammo. Something in my throat. So if that's you, go ahead and click on the link either above or below the video. I will see you inside. Talk to you soon. Have a great day.